Hey gang, hope everybody's doing fantastic today. Um, we're back out here doing our famous windshield tours and we're back out at Entrada, Dear Horton community here in St. Augustine. Just coming through the new entrance they're making. Um, it's getting close to being, it's about probably halfway done. And I wanted to give you guys an update on Entrada. Lots of homes being built in here and they got all the roads put in now. So I wanted to give you guys a nice update. Anyway, um, hope everybody's doing great today. We appreciate you guys riding along with our famous windshield tours. Sharon and I are uh, enjoying a beautiful sunny and 80 day here. Um, we got a client who's building a home in here as a matter of fact. So I got to come in and do an initial video for their personal website that we build for all of our new construction homes. So let's take a little ride around. I'm not going to bore you too much with the details. Um, but uh, most of you look at my other videos, you can see lots of different, the finite details of um, Entrada. It's going to be just under a thousand homes, 40s and 50 foot lots. So let's take a little ride down here. I'll show you kind of where they're doing the, um, there's two areas where they're doing the bulk of the building. So we'll take a little ride here. And um, so things are gonna be really nice. This is gonna be a really, really nice community. And I'll show you, I'm gonna show you all the roads here in just a second. Navigate around all the work trucks and everything. So you see all these sold signs? Sold, 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 sold. It's crazy how many houses are worth selling in St. John's County right now. Um, it's um, it's on fire. So that's but that's good. That's good because every time a house goes up, so does a thousand dollars in your pocket. Um, Dr. Horton. Let's talk a little more specifically about Dr. Horton and how they do things. Um, right now, most builders are not just building homes from scratch. There are a lot of them are doing now inventory homes because of the cost of building materials going up um, so rapidly on some things like lumber and things of that nature. So let me explain to you how what Dr. Horton's doing. You see these homes here. These are all going to be inventory homes, okay? And they don't have their foundations poured yet. Now this is in phase one of of construction. Phase two will be when foundations are poured, and that's when the houses go up for sale now, okay? And as soon as they go up for sale, people are buying them. So if in Trot as a community, or any DR Horton community, um, or any community, actually any builder, if you see a house come up for sale, it's you got in your it's something that can work for you. You gotta really kind of do something about it because it will be sold fairly quickly, okay? Um, we're having, you know, multiple people, multiple offer situations on a lot of construction now. And um, D.O. Horton is not doing that yet, but it may only be a matter of time. So it's still first come, first serve. But um, anyway, so lots of competition. The whole, the, whole, um, the whole crux of that is there is a significant amount of competition for all the homes in St. John's County being built right now. All right. So I'm going to shut the camera off. I'm going to go to the other side of the community and um, we'll start this back up. So sit tight one second. All right. Coming out of this existing area. Now these are all home sites over here as well. Okay. There's going to be a really nice amenity center in here. They finally, they're starting to work on it now. They got the sign up. They've got the land cleared. So we'll stop and look at that as well here in a minute. Back out to our the main road here. Okay. So yeah, if you in the world we're living in in St. John's County right now, and, and there's a lot of other places around the country the same way. If you see a home today, it'll be gone tomorrow. I mean, it's just kind of the way it is. Um, there's our new amenity center space right there. So if they're working on putting all the infrastructure in for that, it's gonna be really nice. Gonna have a pool and fitness and all kind of cool stuff. Okay. There's a lot of competition for these homes. So let's go over here. And that's where they're building their new model. That's gonna be a model home right there. If you can see it past my mirror, sorry. And that's where the new model home is gonna be. So let's uh, let's get out and I'll show you kind of the artist's conception of the, of the uh, amenity center. All right, stand by a minute. Appreciate you guys bearing with us today. It's gonna be a little longer video because I want to try to get the entire community. Oops, sorry about that. All right, I'm blocking my microphone. Sharon, and I do appreciate you guys. This is kind of what the Mendy Center is gonna look like here in Entrada. Very nice. Also, the front entrance they're working on. We came across. So this is where the amenity center is going to be. There's a lot of green space. There's going to be parking. 
they're starting to put in all the, that's where all that heavy equipment is over there. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be very, very nice. All right, so let's get back in the car and uh, keep moving. And like I said, that's their new model home they're, they're building in here. So when that gets done, we'll come back in and uh, we'll get that all filmed, okay? So, sorry about the little shuffle getting out of the car there. I dropped my phone. That's the way it is. You're seeing Dwight in his raw form here. I always say these are my amateur hour videos. I hope you guys like them. Give me a thumbs up or a like or subscribe if they, you know, if you like what I do and it really, you know, if you enjoy them. All right, if we come back over here, we're gonna go around the big circle. You can see they're just clearing more land. There'll be some more roads they're putting in back over here, but we're gonna go back to, there's gonna be what looks like a gated area back here. So that road's gonna be going somewhere back there along that water, along that, that's a nice little marshy area there. It's kind of cool looking. First time I was back here about three days ago and I said, oh, I guess I better get back here and do a updated video here. As most of you know, Sharon and I are sync dedicated single agents. We only work with buyers, both new construction and resales. Um, but in our area right now, new construction is king. Very few resales on the market, and the ones that do come on the market, they're gone within hours. All right, so we don't want to run those guys over. They're probably saying that guy's going to run me over. So new construction is kind of getting the same way. As soon as houses get released by the builders, people are people are buying them up. So this is gonna be a whole nother section back here. This area right here we're going through is gonna be a gated. It appears that it's gonna be gated. So these are got, there's electrical conduits sticking up back here. So there's gonna be something happening back here, but this is just another section that they're putting in roads. Pretty crazy amount of houses that are gonna be in here. Like I said, just under a thousand here in Toronto. Nice green space, nice water space lots. See, all these lots over here are gonna be on that nice body of water. Same over on, you got green space lots over there. You got more water lots over here. So there's gonna be a lot to choose from over. This is probably gonna be a five, ooh, five to six year, seven year build out maybe. I'm guessing they're already putting in some inventory homes back here. Um, I'm not sure what they are, but uh, there, see those are got a bunch of form boards up back there. And they're clearing land behind there as well. It's crazy. But that's what's happening in St. John's County right now. We are we are one of the places in the country people are moving to. And there's gonna be more of the community back over there. So anyway, questions or comments, give us a shout. We're here for you guys, we're here to help. Um, we love helping folks um, get into new homes, create the uh, environment for a great journey. So um, if we can help, give us a call and give me a like or subscribe and we do appreciate everything. Thanks guys.